there is no doubt the California Coastal National Monument has walked on shore at Point Arena. So what you've done here in the Point Arena Starnetic Public Lands, besides connecting this piece of land to 1,100 miles of coastline and all of those rocks out there that are part of the California Coastal National Monument, is you've put this place on the map so that other people will make the trip out here and enjoy it. And when they do that, they'll support your local businesses. And they'll learn about the first people that walk these lands. There is a group here that are known as Team Stornetta. I want you to raise your hands if you're part of Team Stornetta. That's part of the core crew that's made this possible. Um, I'd like to thank uh, President Obama for uh, signing this act uh, and protecting this property out here. Thank you, President Obama and Secretary Jewell, for all you've done on behalf of the environment. The kids are very excited about the fact that President Obama just yesterday signed the Point Arena Stornetta Public Lands as part of the California Coastal National Monument. And uh, those of us in the White House got to see the great uh, watercolors that the students uh, at the charter school sent to the First Lady uh, to express uh, in painting what we're all getting to see today. Yeah, and where we're standing right now was recently recognized by the New York Times as the third most sought after place to visit in 2014 on the entire planet. Ever since I was very small, my dad, who was a watercolorist, took me outside on painting trips. And in my office right now is hanging a watercolor of the Point Arena Lighthouse taken, painted from a spot on the Point Arena Stornetta public lands. The beauty here is incredible. It's, um, it's a little piece of paradise. And whenever I encourage people to come up and visit us, it's because I'm so proud of what we have to offer. Redwood Falls.